In this clip, you're going to hear from Laura Bates. Laura Bates is an activist and writer. She wrote a seminal book, Everyday Sexism, in 2012. And in this clip, she's talking at WOW Presents about the systems that society has in place that keep sexism alive. And she's talking about the fact that very often people are always saying, well, girls and women, this is how you need to keep yourself safe. These are the actions you need to take. This is what you need to do. Instead of which, maybe we should be having the conversation with boys and men about what they can do to make the world safer for everyone. We have been trained almost from birth to believe it was our fault. You did that wrong. You were asking for it. You should have done that. You shouldn't have been there. You shouldn't have been wearing that. Do you really want to make a fuss about this? You're overreacting. It wasn't because you were a woman. You've got the wrong end of the stick. I'm sure he didn't mean it that way. It was probably just a compliment. It's boys being boys. Lighten up, love. I'd love it if something like that happened to me. We are trained into it to such a degree that in the project entries we receive, they are almost universally peppered with phrases like, I know I'm so lucky, really. I know it could have been much worse. I find it hard not to blame myself. I think that so many of us have been groomed into not allowing ourselves to acknowledge that our experiences have been experiences of systemic oppression. What I realized when I was writing the book was that you can't separate that from the fact that the system is getting away scot-free. If we blame women and if women are trained to blame themselves, then they can't see the system because it's all my silly fault. Oh, I just didn't do this right or that wrong. I shouldn't have been there at that time. I didn't do the right thing. I didn't take the right kind of minicab. I didn't have my keys between my fingers that night. I didn't text someone to walk me home. I wasn't wearing flat shoes. I shouldn't have taken that route through the park. If we are so focused on that, and if other people are so focused on the women and what silly women did wrong, nobody's looking the other way at the system that's really at fault or the men who are committing the abuses. And so it continues and continues.